In my video today, I'm gonna to talk all about what I use as a bookkeeper to track my time. You guys, I heard about this app probably from Vicki Watkins in her Facebook community of bookkeepers. Um, and she gives a free, um, like step-by-step -step what she uses for her bookkeeping business, all the different technology pieces. And I will put that down below, a link to the Facebook website and possibly to her personal website as well, where you can find out more information. But this is one that I really latched onto and that I love. I'm a really organized person. I think that that probably has to do with one of those skills of why I became a bookkeeper in the first place. So I don't feel like time management is something that I struggle with. It's it's not. I can plan out my day and stick to it almost every single time. I'm pretty realistic with myself, which is probably why I named my channel Realistic Bookkeeping. But if even if you are good at time management, it is sometimes hard to log exactly how much time you're spending on a task. And this can be bookkeeping, or this can be your work, or this can be your personal life with cleaning. This is difficult to really sit back after a task is done and reflect on exactly how much time you spent and what time you spent that on. So I am going to talk about Toggle, which is the app that I use every time I'm doing a bookkeeping task to count how long I did that task for. I found it so incredibly helpful, especially because bookkeeping tasks are so detailed and minute that it was like I needed something to tell me, you spent 14 minutes and 27 seconds on this. You spent five minutes and 38 seconds on that. You spent 61 minutes, blah, 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 blah. I needed something to compile that for me and I love that it's color coded, y'all. Color coded? So awesome. I can name it whatever I want. I can make these things like in a group so that I can do multiple tasks and start and stop them, but compile them all into the same name under a project. Love it, I'm in heaven. So beautiful to an OCD type A person. Just a side note here, I think that something like this is incredibly helpful if you're working from home and you're trying to log different things that you're doing throughout your day. Like I said, time management and planning things out is great, but then as a reflective tool of if I'm working from home and one minute I have to lay down my daughter for a nap, the other minute I have to make lunch for my son, and that time in between and when I'm working on different tasks or when it's the evening and I've just laid them down and I wanna watch my show but then I pause that and work on something for a little bit and then I get up and I make myself a cup of coffee because like I need it real time. Um, but this is so helpful when there's this whole other world going around you, right? So if you go to your nine to five job, you know that at nine, you got there and you started working. And you know that at five, you left and you stopped working. No big deal. Maybe you don't need something to track your time there. But especially in this weird world that we're living in where most of us are working from our couch or our bed or our kitchen table, Toggle is going to be so helpful in helping you realize how much time you spent and on what task. Especially when you have to bill your client for how much time you spent on it. I'm actually going to, in this video, show on my screen a little recording of how you go and do the Toggle app and like what you do with it, but just some highlighted features for you of this app and what it can offer you as a bookkeeper or just time tracking in general. You can name your project, you can color code your, your project, and then you can start and stop your project whenever you need to. You get weekly reports emailed to you of what your time was broken down with and your total amount of time spent on each project that week. You can track when you're the busiest and kind of plan out a calendar on Toggle in order to kind of monitor when you were working and when you weren't. And it is so easy to understand. I don't like technology just for technology's sake. I like it to be fast and efficient and helpful to me and easy for me to use. If it's not easy for me to use, then I'm not gonna use it. And especially when we're talking about something like time, you want it to be efficient with the time that you have. Bonus, it is free. I think there's a premium version of it. I have not played around with the premium version. I'm just using the free edition and it does everything I need it to. I'm sure it has a lot of other capabilities that I just haven't played around with. If you get the premium version and you notice something that could be helpful, leave it down in the comments below. I am going to, in the description of this video, put where you can find the Toggle app and even a link to it so that you can go and download it on your phone or on your computer. But all in all, I just love its simplicity 
Audacity, and here's a quick video recording of me using it on my phone. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please hit subscribe if you have found this useful at all. Um, I am Realistic Bookkeeping, and hopefully I will make another video that will be just as useful to you in the future. Okay, you guys, I am gonna take you really quickly through Toggle Track. So you will see it is the only app on this screen. It says Toggle without an E track, and it looks like a purple power symbol. So if I click on that, then it is going to pull up um, just some of, and it syncs if you kind of pull it down and refresh it. But it is going to show you the like last three projects that I was working on. It says working on these because at the very top, if you have recently been working on a project, you can hit the play symbol right next to it and it will automatically start to track that time. And then you can hit this stop symbol in the bottom right hand side and you'll see it populate up into today's category. I am going to delete that because obviously I am not working on that project right now. Um, and I'm going to delete these other two so that I can show you just an example of what you can do with Toggle as far as creating a project and tracking your time on it. So if you hit the bottom right hand side, this little play symbol, then it's going to ask you and it's going to immediately start recording what type of task you're working on. So let's say I put in here example, if I can spell correctly, example project task, and I can hit just the check mark and say, okay, it's good. I'm going. And then when I have a little bit more time, I can come back and I can click on what I'm working on and edit the task. And right underneath of the name, it says add project task. I can click that and then I made this example down below work fun. But you can just start typing any project that you'd like for this to add into. So let's say I had a new business that I'm working on. And then underneath it says create that project. So I'm going to create one and maybe I'll color it in green um, and I can make it private or not private and then hit create. And so the example project task that I'm working on will now always be linked to that new business. And I can confirm the changes and it's still recording this entire time that I've created that project and that task. So at any point that I'm done, I can hit the stop button and it will go ahead and put it under today and it will tally it up. So let's just show or go into an example from Saturday where I logged four hours and 59 minutes and 53 seconds. You can see the task and the project that I color coded this to for the client I'm working with. But if you hit, see that number four and you click on that, it will drop down that I didn't actually just spend four hours and 59 minutes straight on this task. I did lots of different time increments and you can click on each one and see when I started and stopped that. And I can go back and change this if that was incorrect. So there were times where I worked for two hours, then 30 minutes, then 11 minutes, and then a last session of two hours and five minutes. And all of those together tallied up for that one four hours and 59 minutes session. And you can go back through. What's really nice about Toggle is that it will send you a weekly report on what you've been working with. Um, and this is just a little bit about what Toggle can do. You can go in, um, there's a calendar mode where you can do certain things. Um, there is, let's, so that was on Saturday. Let's see, I can zoom out and show the different times that I worked on this project. I can go to the, um, bar chart and go for, let's say I want to go for, I don't know, uh, this week. I can look at this week and show where I'm tracking hours. I've, I don't have any hours tracked because I just deleted them for this week, but um, I just think that this is a really great app for you to track your time and um, help you with a little bit of your time management as far as what you've been spending your time on.